We were back on the trail, and now there wasn't any question about the direction the creature was headed. If the Indian legends were correct, we were nearing the heart of Sasquatch country. The storm broke, and we were to enjoy a few warm days of Indian summer. We continued our journey with the ever-present feeling of uneasiness. Oh. In the next valley What's was the most oh. awesome sight I had ever seen. Yes. That's the way the Sasquatch marks the outer perimeter of his domain. It's incredible. Incredible. It is as the ancient ones have said. The Sasquatch are in the place of the three valleys. From here we go with danger. The broken trees at that height indicated a creature that could stand over 10 feet tall and weigh better than a thousand pounds. It was a frightening realization. The tremendous strength it would have taken to break those trees off so cleanly. And I think we all began to understand the danger we were in. There were no sounds of the forest. It was obvious to all of us that we were now in the heart of the Sasquatch domain. There were tracks everywhere in the soft earth of the meadow, of different sizes and moving in different directions. We reached the third valley. Here you could feel the presence of Sasquatch. We could catch a faint odor on the wind. The valley opened into a large meadow surrounded by dense forests and a lake protected the north entrance.